Hello, Harumi. Thank you for your availability. Hi, Marcia. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you? Good. All right. So, uh, would you like to introduce yourself, please? Okay. So, my name is Harumi Sanchez. Uh, I'm from Spain and I decided to do this semester uh, for bag design and construction here at Arsutoria. What is your background, Arumi? Well, um, I've been working in the shoe sector uh, for the past two years and I do marketing for a shoe brand. Okay, so why did you choose to take the uh, back semester diploma program? Because um, a few years back I studied fashion design and I didn't really like it and I was actually looking for something that was a lot more practical and I had heard of Arsutoria for many many years but I never really looked into it I just heard comments and like people recommend it and then finally I was like okay I'll look into it and then I researched a little bit about it and I was like this is exactly what I was looking for and so yeah then I decided to get in contact with the school and I came here you are, in spite of COVID, here you are, finally, we made yeah, it. Uh, by the way, we're running the, the interview like this to uh, to keep the uh, social distance. I'm in the office, you're in the lab, but at least we don't have to wear the mask. Yeah. So, um, how did the, the program go with uh, the different classes? Can you tell us a little bit about it? Yeah, well, I mean, it's amazing. Uh, even if it was part of it online because of the situation right now, I think the teachers are super good they're always there for you they help you with anything that you need and the first course that i did was the bag branding which working in marketing already kind of gave me like a lot of knowledge prior knowledge uh, for the course but there were a lot of things that i was lacking because i had never studied marketing before so i think that the branding course just like gives you like a better idea of how to like start up a brand and the essential things that you need to take into account before you get to start producing, you know? So I, th I thought that was super good. Then after that course, we did the bag design, which it's amazing because it's super technical. So I knew how to draw a little bit, but you're never too good. You can always improve. So I thought that the um, our teacher Marta she was very specific so we would do drawings and practice a lot all the time and it would just like we just became better and better and we started taking things into account about bag details that we didn't know before so our knowledge just expanded in that area and in general like the whole class like you could see how everyone was becoming better at the actual design and the reality of how to take a drawing into an actual bag. Did you actually succeed in developing a full collection by the end of the throughout bag branding and marketing strategy and then the bag design class? Yeah, and I thought it was actually really good because if I wouldn't have done the bag branding course, then I wouldn't actually know or understand what the idea or the communication that I wanted to bring was or would be. So because I did the back branding, I knew my style a little better and I knew my consumer a little better, which allowed me to create a collection that actually represented what I wanted to do. So I thought that was really good. And yeah, by the end of the bag design course, I had to develop a collection of my own based on the things that I like and that inspire me and just the whole process and how everything flows from beginning to end is very smooth so it just gives you like a lot of just understanding of how the process should be all right thank you and what about the class that you're currently taking the bag pattern making and prototyping one well how's that going well i'm smiling because i love it i mean not to put anything down but this one is my favorite because i I was looking for the technicality and the doingness, you know, like getting like hands-on projects and here is like super hands-on, like 
everything you're doing, it's hands-on. You're never just sitting and listening or reading a book. Like it's not like that. You are drawing while well, drawing. You're making patterns. You're cutting patterns. You're cutting fabric. You're cutting leather. You're cutting. You're like doing all the time, which gives you so much reality. You know, reality with how it is supposed to be done. And so now that um, we're actually at the end of the course, I I see it and I actually talk to my parents and I talk to my partner about it and I'm like, I would have never known that this was supposed to be that way or I should have left 0.5 here or blah, like it's so specific. Like I have so much knowledge that even without the teacher, I can figure out solutions for my pattern problems which is i think something i wouldn't be able to do if i would have if i wouldn't have done this course of course right great well this is a purpose to have our students become independent with their pattern making prototyping and they have the understanding as you said i want to design i design which is basically the aim of the final project designing uh, your own bag and then developing the sample of it. Yeah. Do you already have an idea about what you're going to be doing? Because that's going to happen in a couple of weeks. Yeah, <laughs> well, I mean, I just started thinking about it. Um, but I mean, right now I am thinking of doing a doctor bag, which is with a frame and it's just it seems or it looks very intricate. But now that I have all the understanding of how everything is, it doesn't seem that intricate. It seems very simple because I understand that this, the certain parts of the bag are supposed to be done in a certain way and the measurements, like I, I understand it so well that it doesn't confuse me when at the beginning, like I didn't know anything about it. It would create like this feeling of like, it's impossible that I would ever make something like this, but now it's just so real. Good. Well, we, we, I, I wish you to enjoy the final project because this is quite important. And if you enjoy it, it will will come out nicely. So um, now that you are almost done with the, with the program, uh, what is your project with the new skills and uh, knowledge that you have acquired in this semester? What do you want to do? Well, uh, what I want to do is create my own capsule collection of designs and bags. Uh, that would be sold in the company that I work at, which is my parents' company. And they've had bag collections in the past, but they don't have an actual bag designer. So I feel like me doing this course, in a way, it's part of the purpose of helping them as a family company kind of increase or grow uh, as a brand. So I, yeah, my idea is to start with a small capsule collection and then after that, continue with maybe like a bigger collection or a more stable and then from there create my own brand at the end in the future <laughs> it sounds it sounds great good luck with that and now the very last question since you're almost done with the program um think about yourself a year ago when you started uh, looking to the program now that you've almost done and you're a student almost an alumni would you be recommending this to your um, other students? Yeah, of course. I mean, I already knew it was going to be great, but I I think if you're looking, if if you like design, if you like bags, if you like leather goods, I feel like this is just the perfect place to learn all the things that you need to learn to be able to go ahead in the future in in this sector and I mean to me it's been like super super valuable and I don't think I would find this anywhere else so I fully fully recommend it it's so much fun it's so much hands-on and I don't know I think if you're looking into doing a course that would help you do bags or shoes because they also do shoes. I think this the school is the perfect fit for you. Thank you so much, Arumi, and good luck again for your new project. Thank you.